name's Brianna Kegelman. I'm 16 and I'm in 11th grade and I'm da daughter of Paul Kegelman who's been chatting your ear off. And I'm here to talk to you about my superhero, my brother. When I was in 9th grade, it was our first day of high school and it was our first English class from middle school into high school. So it was a really big deal. And it was time to write our first high school essay. The topic was, who is your superhero? And everyone around me started like shouting things like Justin Bieber, I mean, fully they could see him now, and like other <laughs> actors and actresses, and then some kids press, shouting presidents to try to sound smart. But the absolute first person that popped in my head was my brother, David. David was born of cognitive delays and mild mental retardation. Then when he was around 18, he was diagnosed with schizophrenia, which is a mental illness that consists of auditory and visual hallucinations. So he would hear voices and see things. And growing up with my brother and in this environment was really difficult. There were a lot of questions that would be constantly floating through my head, all of them wondering why, focusing on this one word, why. Why is my brother so different? Why can't we go out to certain places? Why can't I have these friends over? Why us? Why me? Why my brother? I wasn't proud of thinking these questions, but it was the truth. That's what I was struggling with. And all of these questions just ended up boiling into anger. And I lived with this anger with me for a very long time. And everything happens for a reason. Now I'd like to end with just a little excerpt from my original paper I wrote in ninth grade. I love my brother with all my heart. David inspires me every day in so many ways. I now understand what family really means and what it means to stick together through all the hard times. And that you can survive through mental illness and there's a brother brighter future on the other side. Thank you.